Okay, so here are the instructions on how to download your copy of the COVID-19 screening tool using Google Forms. Now, Google Forms can be used with any device, whether it's an Apple or an Android or a PC desktop, uh, as long as you can log into a Google account and get access to Google Forms. So what you'll want to do first is log into your Google account, which I already am. And then now you want to create a folder where you're going to save the Google Forms to. So you go into the Google Apps icon on the top right hand side of your screen and you click on Drive and you want to create a new folder and you can name it anything you want for me I'll call it COVID-19 and you create. Now you've created this folder where you can save your Google Forms and also you can save the spreadsheet into, Google, into this COVID-19 uh, folder as well for easier reference later on. So the next thing you want to do then is go to the email that I sent you and the email will have a link and that link has at the end of it the word copy. That's the one that you click on and it'll take you to another screen that says would you like to make a copy of COVID-19 screening and you say yes I'd like to make a copy and it redirects you to a purple background screen. Now this is your copy of the Google Forms so you can edit it and customize it in any way you wish um, at this point. I can send a video to help you with that uh, later on. So once you've got this form in front of you you want to save it into that folder that you just created. So you go up to the top left hand side here it says move to folder and you find the name of your folder and you say move. So now you can find your forms uh, anywhere in that in your Google Drive. One more thing that uh, I do too is I save it as a bookmark um, and that makes it a lot easier uh, for your staff to be able to access it when they're with a patient. That way they don't have to keep clicking into Google Drive and whatnot. And in order, there's different ways that you get into bookmarks or, or saving the, uh, the link. Uh, but in this particular situation, you go on that top right hand side and you click on bookmarks and you bookmark this page and that's where you get that. So hopefully this helps. If you have any questions, you can email me. That's a great way to contact me and uh, I will be following up with another video on how to update the COVID-19 screening tool.